Save up on your electricity bill with Solco Solar Water Heaters. News first previously reported on the inconveniences faced by farmers after the weight of fertilizer bags distributed among them did not match the 50 kilogram quantity as indicated in the packet. Yesterday, News first carried out an investigation into the supply chain of the fertilizer from the port to the Timbulketia Agrarian Services Center. Our investigation revealed that the bags of fertilizer had reached the storage facility of the Agrarian Services Center bearing the actual weight of 50 kilograms. News First was granted permission to inspect the fertilizer storage facility upon request made to the Assistant Commissioner of the Agrarian Development Authority in the Ratnapura district. However, upon reaching the location, our reporter was informed that we would not be allowed to inspect the facility without the presence of National Fertilizer Secretariat officials and the permission of the respective ministry. At around 10 a.m. today, the Assistant Commissioner of the Agrarian Development Office had informed our reporter to visit the location after two hours after pointing out that the quantity of the fertilizer in the bags has not been reduced. Farmers associations pointed out that the bags of fertilizer had been weighed and stored in a separate area in the facility when we reached the location. Our cameras captured the manner in which holes had been inserted in several bags of fertilizer. We will carry out a comprehensive investigation based on the information that we have received. In the future, we will have the farmers come to the Govijana centers to monitor the activities of the distribution of fertilizer. Today they are asking that the bags be weighed. Why did they not allow this yesterday? Farmers also alleged that there were lights turned on in this store last evening. Then the concern arises whether they had done something with those lights on. What should those officials do if they are in fact innocent? Prior to the reporters arriving there and demanding so, they should have invited them to weigh the fertilizer and see that everything is in order. This will show that the issue arose after they took this outside. Now finally, it is possible that those innocent farmers will be held responsible. <laughs> Fifty kilogram bags of fertilizer are sold at around 2,300 rupees in the market. Given that a kilogram of fertilizer has been priced at 115 rupees, a total of 57,500 rupees could be laundered illegally through the sale of 105 kilogram bags at a lower weight. The farmers who toil hard to meet the rice consumption of this country continue to engage in farming amidst a plethora of hardships. The harvest they reap is the result of daily battles due to drought, flood and even the threat of fall armyworms that feed on their crops. It is only fertilizer that is offered as a concession for these farmers who work hard throughout their lives to fulfill the hunger of the people. Against such a backdrop, shouldn't individuals involved in such fraudulent activities be ashamed of themselves?